After several hours of discussions behind closed doors in this New York hotel, ECOWAS leaders announced new sanctions against the military junta in Guinea. It has been decided to take gradual sanctions on individuals against the Guinean junta. Very quickly, ECOWAS will drop a list of people to be sanctioned and progressively apply these sanctions. The Guinean military, which came to power through a coup in September 2021, intends to rule for three years before handing over to a civilian government. Ahead of the meetings, the acting president of ECOWAS told France 24 this was unacceptable. We spoke about it and agreed that it can't be longer than 24 months. This is non-negotiable for ECOWAS. This comment provoked fury from the Guinean military junta before the sanctions were even announced. Crude lies and intimidation are backward steps that dishonor the person who spoke them, as well as ECOWAS's image. Also on the agenda at this special summit, ECOWAS leaders demanded the release of 46 Ivorian soldiers in Mali, described as mercenaries by the ruling Malian junta. In a show of unity, representatives from Guinea and Mali's military governments met in Bamako on Thursday to celebrate the anniversary of Mali's independence. Both remain suspended from ECOWAS bodies.